Okay. Hi guys. <laughs> All right, so we're going to jump into your reading. This is going to be for Scorpio. We're going to do a singles read. Um, let's see if this resonates for you, Scorpio singles. If it doesn't, don't worry about it. It's just a reading, a general. If you want a personal reading, all the information will be in the description box down below. But when I do give you guys a time or a date, just know that it is not confirmed until payment has been received. Um, so keep that in mind. Uh, it is first come, first served when it comes to payments for a slot. Um, so yeah. Uh, the membership is activated, you guys. So I'll be going live on January 2nd. In I believe it's going to be in the morning, you guys, because... I have to get ready and head out the next day, so I just want to get that out of the way. I have a lot on my plate this month, and yeah, I know that a lot of you know what's going on, but I also have my own personal issues that I'm going through, so there's a lot going on. All right, so let's just get entwined with it and see what we have for you. Singles, Holy Spirit, what's the energy for singles? What's the overall energy for singles for Scorpios? Hmm. I'm hearing choose your battles wisely. Choose your battles wisely. I'm seeing you into a lot of shit. Okay. That your angel guides do not want you to be in. Um, a lot of you, this is because of a relationship. Okay. From an Aries Leo or a Sag or even a Cancer. Okay. That I'm seeing rushing towards you. And this is someone that you decided not to speak to because of the commotion that happened. I'm seeing that a lot of you are stressed out about the situation even today, making decisions based on fear, okay, as well. I'm also seeing the Five of Wands energy and the Eight. So you feel very trapped within the situation here. Very trapped, very restricted. Um, this person doesn't want to tell you the truth. Hmm, you feel like they were involved with someone else or they were shady? Do you feel like they weren't on your side? <sighs> There's a lot of different people here. I'm seeing that you're having an anxiety. And a lot of you weren't talking to this person and here they are. This doesn't have to be a relationship because I'm not getting a romantic relationship for everything. I'm getting like there was a connection, singles, and this person, this situation, had a whole bunch of other people that is involved with this situation. And you had to defend yourself. You were defending yourself, but at the same time, you don't know what happened and why they felt this way towards you. And you're still trying to find out because you're like, why? Why me? Why are they people picking on me? I don't understand. This is a constant vibration, by the way. So a lot of you are experiencing this right now. The Nine of Swords, the Five of Wands, the Eight of Swords is all constant in the present moment. Oof. you're second guessing yourself you're like going back into the details of everything and trying to find out like did I say something wrong did I do something wrong sorry that this is going in and out you guys the um this phone sucks let me just tell you <laughs> the quality I can't I, see look at that how it's dark and then it's light and then it's dark I don't know but I'm just seeing like, after all the commotion, here they are coming towards you, but you're blocking this person's energy. You're blocking them. You're blocking them. You don't have no time for this mess. 
but this person is rushing, rushing off after you, excuse me, and trying to have you forgive them for what they have done. It's like I'm hearing you, they know not what they have done. For some of you guys, you're dealing with a multiple people. It's so heavy, you, you can't breathe, singles. The commotion is so much, and I feel like this is about family, or this could be about friends. Friends that are jealous of whatever you got going on. And now someone is trying to prove themselves to you, the main one. The Holy Spirit is saying this already had taken place. This this uh this fudgery, the fudgery have already taken place. All right, you need to trust your intuition here within the moon. This was shady. This was a lot of secrets. This is why this person wants another. They want to plead for another chance or start over again. Plus, they're saying that you have some kind of connection, okay, that you, you can help them with because they're looking at you as the Queen of Wands energy, like that that energy to help them with their, their, their whole life that's going downhill. You're supposed to bring things to life within their, their, their situation. You know, you give them that, that determination, you push them, you give them that warmth, that security in life, and they need that. Meantime, they don't, it's like I'm getting like they're trying to start over with you, you know, but they don't give you that same energy, that same vibration. So this person cares about you, though, when it comes to the heart, but you don't see that there's a future. You don't know if you can do this anymore because of the shadiness. I'm just getting a lot of shadiness singles. A lot of shadiness. You don't trust this person whatsoever. You're saying that friends are not your friends. You don't know who to trust. This person is trying to come in. It's night. No, they're acting like a knight. They're coming towards you with knights. Trying to be very charming here. Trying to look like they're trustworthy. Like they have your back. They have your heart. You know, they're protecting you. Whatever they're doing or saying they're saying that they did it for you. Like, I did it for you. Okay, tell me more. All right, so we have the Six of Pentacles here. Oof, so, uh, okay, hold on, y'all. Something about your stability and where you're going to go. You're very successful. You're very successful and you have a difficult decision to make. I'm seeing a conversation coming up because for some reason, this uh, Ten of Cups energy, this home vibration, you don't know where it's going to go because obviously it's shady, it's in reverse, but someone wants to work something out with you. Okay, you have the 1111. This is also about your home. Okay, a lot of you could be staying with family um, or trying to get away from family here, but you're saying either way, it's no balance here. There's no balance. Okay? You're trying to rip yourself apart from this situation because you're, you're experiencing loss and depression. You feel like these people are just not for you. You're disappointed. You're going through some form of disappointment. Singles. You're putting your feet down though. There's some kind of watching you. Someone is watching you here because you're trying to tear yourself apart from this this um this energy they're watching you in silence <laughs> there's no stability this is what i'm seeing no stability within this pentacles the knight of pentacles it's crazy how all the knights are coming out for you and they're in the upright but the stability but the stability and you already have like balance it's just 
the balance within this connection is just not there. And you had enough with the Wheel of Fortune. You don't, you're not vibing with this person. They want to give you back something, though, because I'm seeing them coming back. But they're also coming back with the same energy. This person got a lot going on. And they're coming back very quickly, too, within this Ten of Wands. A lot of you could be dealing with a Sag. Don't have to be. But they have Sag energy. I'm seeing Gemini as well. I'm seeing Aquarius. I'm seeing Scorpio. I'm seeing Taurus. I'm seeing Leo. I'm seeing Cancer. Okay, as major arcanas. Pisces. Capricorn. Wow, Saj is also coming back out. Okay, so this person is giving me vibes of it, like if they're stuck into a situation, a toxic environment, because I'm seeing like they're toxic or they're stuck in a toxic environment. This is what I'm seeing here. And there is some kind of addiction or some kind of bad behavior that this person normally does. And I feel like they see it within themselves, but it's hard for them to come out of it or even change at this moment. The The main thing about this singles, I just feel like this energy that I'm getting for you is an energy that one thing I can say is that they know what they want um, in the situation. And they know that they want to rebuild with you. But I'm also seeing a lot of devastation a lot of more trials and tribulations and a lot of you have history with this person but it's a lot of embarrassment a lot of coldness a lot of tension a lot of conflicts conflicts is coming up twice you guys the angels are saying choose yourself at this point because you're going to have to nurture yourself you're going through so much constant look at this person stabbing you in the back how many times oh my gosh over and over again and keeping you restricted so no one wants to tell you the truth here but it seems that you're going to be very successful and this is why this is why they can't be on your level but they want to be in your life okay tell me more they want to be in your life all right, so you have the Hermit in reverse, okay? And then you have the Three of Swords. And I just feel like within the Wheel of Fortune, like, you know, you're just like enough is enough and it happened and you feel like you have learned what you needed to learn from the situation. Now you're ready to move on. Even if you're going to give this person a second chance, singles, um, this energy that's coming up here and I'm seeing multiple people that are after you and your heart is broken because you felt like this person caused this this one person that's coming back in caused this situation you don't know what they said or what they have done and I'm seeing that you're feeling like you're pushed into some kind of healing energy like you you you, you didn't think that I'm seeing like this is very overwhelming for you and you're being pushed into some kind of healing energy. This is not, you didn't go into this healing willingly. You know, you didn't come up with it. You you feel like you had to count on, count on the angels. You had to learn this because you needed this because of this heartbreak. You know, this was, you were in a dark place, dark place. Wow, but there is going to be some form of breakthrough coming in. There is going to also be a completion here because there's a lot of jealousy. There's a lot of jealousy. And also, you guys, the Wheel of Fortune is in reverse. It has to be turned back around. So talk about karmic, huh? Somebody's going to have to learn here. But this is what I have, singles. I hope that it resonates. And if it does, you know what to do. Like the video, comment down below, support each other. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.